So for a long time growing up, I viewed being a follower of Christ as you can't do this, you can do this. These are your restrictions and limitations of what's good and what's bad. Um, but I didn't think there was any freedom in that. And I was afraid that in doing that, I would be handing over my individuality and my identity. Um, so I kind of put that off and just walked in the world and lived a very secular life. And it never fulfilled me, it never sustained me. And I could vividly hear God in a couple instances just be like, are you done? Like, are you ready to give your life over to me? Are you ready to let me have control? And I would literally tell him no, um, because I wasn't sure that in doing that, it would turn out the way that I wanted it to turn out. Yeah, I think my faith and just truly, truly trusting in God's plan. I think Dance Man I's favorite verse is Proverbs 3, 5, mm -hmm. um, which everyone knows, but it's like the most simple, but mm -hmm. like prevalent. And mm -hmm. you can't, like you can't live life without, without that. Yeah. yeah.